Hello friends, this video of Trigonometry Part 11 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched Trigonometry Part 1 to Part 10. Now we will take Trigonometry Function Pi plus minus x. Here please note only sign will change, function will not change. For example, when I say cos of pi minus x, this will become either cos plus x or cos minus x. When I am saying cos of plus minus x, that is when I am saying cos of pi plus minus x, so this is, will become plus minus cos x, either plus or cos minus, that we will find from this equation. So this is first quadrant, this is second, this is third and this is fourth quadrant. So when I say cos of pi minus x, if this is x, pi minus x will somewhere come in this range, correct. This total is pi. And from this you are subtracting x so this is pi minus x so we are now concerned about second quadrant so in second quadrant only sign is positive so this guy is negative so since we know this is negative this becomes negative sign sign changes but not the function here sign of pi minus x we know that sign is positive in this so this guy will become, become positive function will remain same for tan of pi minus x, tan is uh, negative, so tan of pi minus x is negative. Now when you consider pi plus x, if this is x, pi plus x will be, if this is x, pi plus x will be third quadrant. So when I am talking about pi plus x, here in third quadrant only tan is positive. So cos is negative, so we have this negative here. Similarly sin is also negative because only tan is positive but tan is positive here. That's how we have seen. So you don't need to remember all this. If you remember all this, all sine tan cos, then you can actually find whether if this is x, pi minus x comes in which quadrant and then you can find the values, whether it is positive or negative. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.